Once upon a time there was a doctor, and he worked on a psychiatric ward. He had three patients who were called Tom, Dick and Harry. The doctor decided to perform a small experiment to see just how sane or otherwise each of these three patients were. He gave each of them a spider and asked them to find out as much as they could in one week. One week later, the doctor went back to Tom and asked him what he'd found out about his spider. Tom was quite pleased with himself and said, I've discovered that spiders have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight legs. They have eight legs. Very good, said the doctor, and he moved on to Dick. Dick, what have you discovered about spiders? Look, said Dick, my spider has spun a web. I've discovered that spiders spin webs. Very good, said the doctor, and he moved on to Harry. So, Harry, said the doctor, what have you discovered about spiders? Well, says Harry, something rather unexpected. Watch this. And Harry placed his spider on the table and said, Spider, forward three. Sure enough, the spider took three steps forward. Harry then said, Spider, left three. And the spider moved three steps to the left. Spider, back three. The spider moves back three spaces. Spider, right three. And the spider then took three paces to the right. Goodness, said the doctor, that's amazing. No, not at all, said Harry. This is the amazing bit. And he picked up the spider and pulled off each of its legs. He then placed it back on the table and said, Spider, forward three. The leg the spider just sat there. Left three. Back three. Right three. And each time the leg the spider just sat there on the table. The doctor shook his head and said, So what does that prove? That, said Harry, proves that spiders can't hear you when you pull their legs off. So what's the moral of this tale? The moral is, just because you come to a conclusion based on what you see, that doesn't make it right. Some explanations make much more sense than others.